Pamu kindly sent me another earbud to review. This time it's actually called Pamu's Slide 2. I don't think I actually reviewed Pamu's Slide 1, uh, but this one is actually uh, the Red Dot winner of 2022, and it actually comes with the hybrid active noise cancelling, AI smart call noise cancelling, and a voice enhancement system as well. It's a Bluetooth 5.2 and an in-ear detection uh, function as well and um, I believe this also comes with a wireless function as well. So um, Pamu uh, earbuds, I actually have reviewed quite a few of them so far. Uh, please do check it out. They're really really good sounding earbuds indeed and I hope this is going to be one of the best so far because the last time was really really good indeed. Anyhow enough said let's get into the unboxing so here it goes. Nice, look at that. Pamu. All right, so we got the nice Pamu pouch. Carry protection your earbuds. That's very nice. And a standard USB-C cable indeed. All right, so these are the selection of earplugs that you can get, but we're gonna go for the average size. This is the instruction manual that you could quickly pause and have a look so indeed it's a slide so this one comes with six hours of play time of each earbuds and also you can charge up to three times okay uh, so it's quite chunky compared to the um, other earbuds that i actually reviewed so if we were to take this one out um, and then compare with the sony xm4 earbud case so overall it's taller um, slightly thicker but similar shape and also um, wider as well. So that's the overall impression I get so far, but I guess mainly it's due to the sliding capability. So does it slide this way? Oh, I see. That's a nice feel, look at that. I could do this all day long. So there's the bit of the spring reaction there we got here. So it's like, hey man, would you like to try my earbuds? So if we were to take out one of the earbuds, that's how it looks like. Uh, I like these sort of designs actually. It's not as, you know, like pointy as the Apple earbuds, if you see what I mean. And if I were to check it against the Sony XM4 earbuds, here it is. We all know that Sony XM4 earbuds are really chunky indeed, but so the similar size, isn't it? With regards to the overall length itself, but thickness, it's far more th thicker on the Sony XM4 earbuds. If we actually were to compare it overall, um, I'm sure there's a good reason why Sony XM4 earbuds is that thick because of the noise cancelling function mainly, isn't it? But um, just because it's thicker doesn't mean it's always better, okay? Pamu earbuds sound really good indeed. It's very light as well, which is very good. So for those who are wondering what the battery level is, you just need to put this back here and then slide it back and hopefully, you'll be able to see the battery life gauge here. So that kind of shows that it's about 80 to 90. So it's all good to review indeed. So as you can see, I'm using the Pixel Stand to actually wirelessly charge the Pamu Slide 2. And you can clearly see that the gauge is going up, which means it's charging. So it is a wireless charging function indeed. So well done. So let's do a regular binaural sound test between the Pamu Slide 2 and my Sony XM4 here, which I will simultaneously connect with my Samsung C4 III with my bruv here. So let's carry out the test. Here it goes.
so as usual, I got the Pamu Slide 2 on my right hand side and Sony XM4 earbuds on my left hand side. It's simultaneously connected to my Samsung C43. So I'm going to play the track called Utopia by Ashutosh. So here it goes. Okay, so the Sony XM4 uh, earbuds is actually on the excited mode. Um, and the Pamu Slide 2 is also on the um, ANC active noise cancellation mode as well. I can see that the Sony XM4 feels more blocked out, but um, it's actually slightly blurred. I would like to say the Pamu Slide 2 is more... There is, the ANC is not as good as Sony XM4, but it's actually slightly more refreshing. I don't know whether you agree or understand that term, refreshing. Sony XM4 is about 0.025 seconds slightly quicker uh, than the Pamu Slide 2. And both of them sound really good. Obviously, we know how good Sony XM4 is, but um, regards to the sound balance, they're both actually on the center, which means that both have the similar strength on the sound. Treble, they're pretty much the same. But it comes to the beats. It's on your own preference, okay? So if you want this sort of like a bit blurred but stronger impact of beats on the excited sound mode on Sony XM4, then you're gonna like the XM4 sound. But if you like a bit more relaxed but slightly sharper sort of beats that is actually customized for you, designed by um, Pamu, then you're gonna like Pamu too. So it's, it's, it's actually on your own preference because both of them sound really good indeed. So I'm actually using this voice recorder app that could directly record the sound quality of the mic from Pamu Slide 2. And um, I actually listened to it early on. It seems to be very sharp and very good indeed. It's probably one of the best mic sound that I actually reviewed so far related to the earbuds. So that's really impressive indeed. Well done. So I recall on the Pamu Z1 Pro earbuds that I actually reviewed a while ago, that is one of the best sounding earbuds ever that I actually reviewed. And I would like to say that that same sounding quality has been passed on to Pamu Slide 2. Both of them seem to sound very, very similar indeed. But in this case, on this video, I actually made a direct comparison with the flagship earbuds called Sony XM4. So I hope that was more helpful uh, review so far. But um, yeah, when it comes to Pamu, you're not going to get disappointed at all. If someone asked me, what do you think about Pamu uh, earbuds generally? I would say, go on, get it, because you will never get disappointed. That could, that's how confident I could say when it comes to the brand name called Pamu. Now, um, if I have have to really have a go on the actual overall impression so far is that um, I think the case itself is much chunkier than I actually anticipated. I saw some other people mentioning the same thing on the review. I guess it's one of the main reasons because they want to emphasize the sliding cool effect here. Maybe that's one of the main reason. But I'm also surprised with the battery life itself. Um, the earbuds can only last up to six hours and you could charge up to three times. So you're getting maximum of 18 hours of play time. I think Pamela could do better on the battery life indeed because the sound quality itself um, is really good. I like the feature of the wireless charging and also the gauge of showing how much a battery life indeed and so on. And I hope the binary test that is carried out with my bruv here have actually proved how good the sound quality is overall. Um, but I guess again, Pamu won't let you down. That's the final word I can conclude about the overall um, impression about the brand Pamu and also the slide 2 um, is really good indeed overall I think just if they can make it slimmer and a better battery life that will be almost perfect indeed so I hope this re review actually help you understand what Pamu slide 2 is but if you have any queries please do comment below and thank you very much for watching this video this is LJP Tech all the best bye bye <laughs>